Hi, my name is Michael Chavette. I am a 3D artist based in Orlando, Florida, specializing in environment and prop art. I'll be showcasing some of the projects I've worked on, starting off with Project Ancestors, which focus on a human that has been cursed and transformed into a dog. In order to transform back, the player must collect all the runes and enter the temple, going through a set of challenges to lift the curse. My role in this project was prop artist, creating models in Blender and exporting to Unity. For each of the specified models, I used reference images of Mayan temples and symbols. This included the Temple of Kin, the Runes of Mut, the Well, and Foliage that build the level layout. Moving on to the next project, we have All That Glows, which is a defense fantasy game showcasing the wizard tasked with defending the castle from oncoming attack waves of kobolds, dragon-like creatures. My role in this project was prop artist, creating the castle out of basic meshes and an array modifier to line the bricks alongside the castle. The magical pool also used basic meshes to piece together along with baking a procedural shader onto a plane. The staves were made like one another, only that each staff had their own element, including fire, electricity, and ice. On to the last project. Project Cybernetica is a first person shooter set in a collapsed corporatic city called Saria. The player is sent into the city by an outside organization tasked with securing the weapon that caused the downfall of Saria. I was designated as an environment artist creating brutalist buildings and modular assets. For the buildings, I created modular pieces of a, of a building and exported both high and low poly models to bake and texture in Substance Painter 3D. Then I use a self-made building generator using geometry nodes in Blender that can take the modular pieces and generate a building in height, width, and depth using sliders. Taking the UVs of the building, I match that to the already textured modular pieces and export it to Unreal Engine to be placed in the level. The other assets that I've created for this project were several neon signs, a modular highway, and a modular factory platform. Thank you for your time.